thank you for coming. If you're new, welcome. So glad you're here. And if you're returning, welcome back. So glad you guys are here. Yes, I wasn't, I had posted that I was going to stop doing YouTube um, a little while ago. And I did for a while. But I tell you what, guys, there's been a lot in the last year that has happened. I've lost a lot. And my heart has been broken. And it's still broken. But, you know, sitting around and I'm thinking, you know, I can sit here and self-pity and feel sorry for myself all day long. But does it bring back those that I love? No, it doesn't. And this did bring me some joy um, doing my videos. And so I'm like, you know what, Gloria, get off your butt and do it. it you're being silly and ridiculous. So this is what I'm doing. So I'm back. So, we're doing Mask Monday. All right, what do I have on? So, on my feet, I have on the Hello Kitty, the Cream Shop Hello Kitty um, Moisturizing and Refreshing Foot Mask, the Jehova Oil and Peppermint. Yeah, they're Christmas ones, but it's my last one. I needed to use it, so I'm using it. Um, my lighting is horrible. My ring light went out, and then I got a light bulb that blew this morning, and I can't change them until my husband comes home because I can't reach it. So, we're going to have to deal with it. Let's see. It says, take a step towards baby soft feet. Infused with moisturizing Jehovah oil and refreshing peppermint, these socks, these sock-like masks are formulated to thoroughly soften and nourish to reveal fresh, beautiful feet. Simply slip your feet in the socks and allow the serum to condition. I'm going to leave these on for about 20 minutes. Then I have on the Grace and Stella Everything is Better in Peak eye masks, which you can see through here. And then I have on, this is, I'm not sure who, from, I can't say it. It's a sensitive face mask. Enjoy the sensitive face mask for your beautiful skin without perfume. I got this in a giveaway from um, Pia with Makeup with Pia. I'll link her in the description below. Go check her out. She does some really neat makeup. I love, I, I love watching her. She's very um, joyful and very, she uplifting. She makes me smile when I watch her. And I need to smile more. I don't need to keep crying. And so we're going to leave this one for about 15, 20 minutes too. So while we do that, we're going to talk about a couple things. First, we're going to talk about what I picked up from TJ Maxx recently. Not a lot, but a little. I picked up these um, from the Crim Shop Hello Kitty Softening and Smoothie Foot Mask. This is the pumpkin enzyme foot mask. Uh, with It has a pumpkin vanilla scent pick those up. There's three of them, and I got them on clearance for $5.50 for three. thought that was an excellent deal, and I've had them before, and I really like them, so I picked those up. Then I saw, first time I've ever seen it at my TJ Maxx, the original makeup eraser. Erase all your makeup with just water. This is the Foodie set, the Foodie seven day set right here, and I picked this up for $9.99, which I thought was a good deal. They look like, let's see if I can. Okay, I can't break this still, but anyway, they look like that. I thought they were cute, and at $9.99, uh, yes, please, I'll take those. Then I picked up three from Tree Hut Sugar Scrub uh, Foot, or Sugar Scrub, um, you know, body scrubs, and one of them's already in my bathroom, and it was the pumpkin spice one, which, huh. Smells heavenly. And then I picked up the candy cane one. And I got these for, I think it was $5.99 each, which I didn't think was bad. Oh, and it smells like candy cane. So I got that for the winter. Then I picked up, so I have the pumpkin spice, which I'm using right now. And then I picked up another, and I've had this one before, the velvet coffee. And this one smells, I remember, just like coffee. <laughs> smells wonderful. So that I picked up, those are what I picked up from um, TJ Maxx. I looked at some palettes, but you know, I don't need, I've ordered a bunch of palettes here lately and I just don't need any, so I refrained from it. Then let's talk about my... What is this Ipsy by Boxy Charm or Boxy Charm by Ipsy? Whatever the heck it is. 
But um, used to be just BoxyCharm and then Ipsy and BoxyCharm merged. Anyway, I paid, for me to get this to me, it was $30 and some change. Um, and this is the medium one. There's a smaller one, it's the Glam bag, the little small bag that's, I don't know, I think it's like 16, 17 a month. And you get five items in that, five, sometimes a full size, but mostly just sample size or deluxe size, and you get to choose one. With this one, um, I get their full size, their five full size products, and you get to choose three of them. So I'm doing this one now because I have a ton of samples that I need to use. So, yeah. So, anyway, when you open it up, this is October's box. So, this is, it says BoxyCharm Glam O Ween. Okay. Okay. Oh, and you can do a beauty boost for $15 more a month, but I don't, I didn't do that. Uh, power picks. Oh, and there's also an icon box that comes out quarterly, and I think that's sixty dollars a month uh, quarterly. And it would replace either if you get the Ipsy Glam bag, it would replace that for that month, or if you get this boxy charm, it would replace that for the month. But I don't get that either. So I don't see prices. I should have written prices down, but you know I didn't because. At the time I got this, yeah, anyway. So we're just gonna go through what, yeah. Okay, so they chose for me this Ola Henriksen Truth Juice Daily Cleanser, which I will use, I like this. I've got the vitamin C one, I don't. It cleanses and removes makeup with orange fruit water and PHA. So I look forward to using that eventually. You know, I have a lot I gotta get through. What else did they choose for me? Oh, and then I did get some add-ons too. Oh, this they chose for me. The Biro Celery AHA plus LHA Resurfacing Serum. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Okay, and just open that up. Take a look at it. Okay, so it's only got about, it's just up to there. It's not, you can see it. It's not completely full. All right, but I will try it out. I've heard that viral is really good, so we'll try that out. Okay, I don't have any prices on these. I'm sorry, guys. Anyway, let's see, that was a two. Okay, then the three I chose. The first one is the Pure Leaves Pumpkin Plus Ginger Detoxifying Charcoal Mask. Cause I've been wanting to try this forever, but I don't wanna pay full price. And I could, it was one of my choices. So yeah, I grabbed it. That's what she looks like. That's a full size. So I do look forward to using that. And I think it's got the seal on it. And I will be trying that out really soon. Then I chose the Volition Chocolate Macadamia Hydrating Mask. That just sounded good. And I wanted to try it. So I got that. It says, leading with the ingredients, chocolate and macadamia, this decadently nourishing facial mask contains a skincare Smoothie of hyaluronic acid, vegan collagen, niacinamide, peptides, plant squalane, and alatone, maybe? All right. I look forward to trying that out. Looks like that. And I bet you, hopefully, it has a seal. And it does. Yes, it does. Okay. Then I chose, let's see, my third product that I chose was the Earth Harbor Calypso Vitamin C Moisture Elixir. It has sea berry and CoQ10 in it. I tried, I decided to, that was the only, I didn't see anything else that I really wanted to try. So it's a little vitamin C elixir, so I will be trying that out. 
I'll keep it in the box because we all know that vitamin C, the sun would, yeah, break that down. Okay, then, I don't know why, I didn't add these on. Sorry about that, we got cut off, but it's time for this to come off. I had a phone call, but anyway, let's take this off. That actually feels really hydrating, it feels really good. Take my little eye masks off. I'm gonna leave my foot mask on for a little bit longer. All right, and I think you just let this absorb. I don't remember and I can't. Oh, shoot. Yeah, you just let it absorb in. All right, can we get back to what we were at? I don't remember, I don't remember pitch. I don't know, I have no idea why I got these because I didn't pick them and I didn't put them on add-ons. But anyway, there's some brushes from Ace Pute. I don't know. Somebody made a mistake, I guess, I don't know. But anyway, they look like that. I probably am not gonna unwrap them because I just ordered some really nice brushes and I'm probably just gonna put these in a future giveaway. All right, then I picked up um, Skin & Co. Whipped Cleansing Cream. I wanted to try that out. Not like I don't have enough, but you know, I, mean, you know, I wanted to try it. And I got it at like $3 or $5, remember? $3, I think, or no, $3.50, sorry. Then I wanted to try the um, skin, Saturday Skin uh, Rise and Shine Gentle Cleanser. I got that for you know, I think, were these to get, I don't remember. Anyway, I picked that up. Then I picked up the Rodial <laughs> Vitamin C Brightening Cleanser. I don't know. I don't need all these cleansers, but I want to try them. So, you know, I got them. And then I wanted to try this Milk um, Makeup um, Kush Mascara that everybody talk, talks about. So, Got that to try out. It's just a little sample. Get it out. Just a little sample. I wanted to try it out. So I got that to try. And that's what I got in my BoxyCharm and my add-ons. And what I picked up from TJ Maxx. So let me know in the comments what you think. And I'm glad to see you guys. And I will be, um, yeah. I'm back. I don't know if I'll post as many videos as I used to, but I will be posting. Um, you never know when I might be, so, you know, just kind of keep an eye out. How about that? All right, guys, don't forget to do a thumbs up if you don't mind and comment and um, share with your friends, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye.